50% of people walking and cycling extra to work, to school, to services, um, to social activities is really important. Walking and cycling is great for your health and well-being, uh, it's great for the economy, it's great for productivity and there's no reason why people can't get out and about and walk and cycle more in this beautiful city. I'm really passionate about Exeter. Uh, I live here for, I've lived here for 11 years. Um, I've got two children that have grown up in the city and I really want them to be able to kind of live in a green, kind of ecologically sensitive city that they can kind of have sustainable travel choices and, and can make safe journeys across the city. What we want to do is help create people first cities and people first cities are places where people walk and cycle more. It means people can spend more time, they can relax, it helps build communities, people talk to each other. The whole place becomes more livable, becomes better for everybody. So we've just launched our new free movement project called Freewheeling. Um, the aim of Freewheeling is to get people back on their bikes that might not be confident or people on bikes that have never cycled before. Um, and the main drive of this is that we want people to use bikes to do an activity. So cycling doesn't become the be-all and end-all of the project. You know, we try and do things like pond dipping, go for picnics, build sandcastles, anything where actually the bike is the method of transport to do the activity. So it's actually built in around the activity rather than being the focus of the activity. We already have around 25 cars in Exeter alone, which is fantastic, and we're continuing to grow. Next month though, even more excitingly, we will be relaunching our bikes. So co-bikes will be coming back to Exeter during August. Uh, we will start off with a rollout in the city centre and and then going to new stations around the city, which means everybody can have access to electric bikes just for a pound for 20 minutes. Through the Sport England local delivery pilot, uh, we're working very hard on helping more people walk and cycle. There's a fantastic amount of work going on in the city. Absolutely now is the time for us to help enable more people to walk and cycle. We're working with the County Council, with Exeter City Futures, with Active Devon and a range of local partners uh, targeting 10 workplaces across the city and 10 schools to help more families, more staff and more people in Exeter walk and cycle every day.